What is up guys and girls, it is me Ed Kelly, in today's video we are back on Subnautica. Now in today's episode we are continuing our exploration we did in episode 18 I believe it was, or 19. Wherever the last episode was we went before we did the egg hatching and stuff, and we're going to go back down there and we're going to explore. Now I went ahead and I already procured all the stuff we're going to need for our um, trip and for our uh, upgrade for the depth module, but we'll do that in a moment. But first thing we need to do is we need to say hey Alfred, Alfred. hey Alfred, okay, can you come down here bud? Hey bud. There he is. There's our cute little fellow. The cutest damn little fellow I've ever seen. He's kind of, he doesn't like me very much, I don't think. I think he likes to turn his back to me, maybe because I haven't really been talking to his, the, the Cthulhu mama, you know? She hasn't really been showing up, but, you know. Hopefully now, if we can find her this episode, we will be able to do it. So let's make this death module number two. No, I'm, I'm feeling like we're going to get at least 1,700 meters with this. I, that's, that's what my goal, that's what my goal, that's what my gut is telling me. Um... So he's charging at 75. I completely forgot. I didn't plug him in the last time after we were done. So Barney is going to need to charge for a little bit. And why is there a hole in the wall over there? So 1,700 meters. Perfect. That is actually perfect. Okay. I think that'll actually be more than enough, personally speaking. So we'll do that. We'll fill that hole in and all that. Now, something I was thinking about was I was wondering... It won't be much help because we don't really need it, but I want to load my inventory with these guys. I want to bring at least... One, two, three, four, five. We'll bring seven. We'll bring all of them, just in case. I feel like they have a use, and I'm not sure what it is yet, and I don't want to risk not having those. We'll bring two, the two batteries. Okay, that's good. So we have a pretty... Our inventory is already pretty full. The other thing I was thinking of was possibly yoinking this. We can make both of these, actually. What's this? Radiation helmet? Yeah, we'll swap that out. We're not going into radiation, as far as I know. Actually, I'll keep it, just in case. Just in case, I'll keep it. So we still have a full row. We have six slots, just in case we need them. Um, but yeah, for now, what we're going to wait on, we're going to wait on Pranius Jones to charge. And then as soon as he's fully charged, we're going to head down. Oh, he's actually pretty much done. Okay. So, how many more upgrades? We can't go much farther down, right? Mark 1, right? It's just that. I wish we can get this, but I don't know how to make polyaniline. I don't know how to make that. A thermal reactor would be perfect for down there, I think. Um, but unfortunately, I don't think we can get it. I think he's almost done. Should be up. He's done. Alright, perfect. So, let's take Pranius Jones down, and let's head down to where our Perseus number 2 is. And then we will get ourselves down there and start exploring the cracks in the depths of the ocean beneath us. Okay, now we're back in the undergrowth. Now, I was actually working on the thumbnail for the last video, and I heard apparently the red versions of these guys are called blood rays, I think, or something like that. The ones we saw really far down in the depths where the lava and stuff is, apparently you can get their eggs. So, if we are able to down there, I'd like to take a look. I'm going to keep an eye on him, though. Um... I would like to take a look and see if we can find some eggs for those guys, because having some blood rays or blood mantas, whatever they're called, um, would be really, really cool. Um, I think they're pretty epic looking, honestly. I have to make more fish tanks if we want to keep one grab more eggs, though. I think there's still more stuff we can get. I feel like there is. So we'll have to definitely keep looking at that type of stuff and seeing if we can get anything new. An excellent looking... Ooh, sulfur. Grab that one. There's some nickel here too and some rubies over there as well hey a ruby over there too hey it's Christmas morning all right so here's our drop off right here let's head down into the depths Stand by for Titan Ball. Schwaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
drill of some kind and I Why do I never get like any of this? There we go. You say like, why do I never get any of this stuff? I think it's just the way this the resource drills, honestly. What is making all this noise in the background? What is that? Is that the little fishies? Okay, is this the hole right here? Are we already up on it? Yep, here it is. Okay. So this is the hole I was thinking about last time. So we just jump down it, I guess? Yeah, let's do it. Stand by for Titanfall. There's a hole that way? Okay. Alright, we are officially past 1300 meters. This is the deepest we've ever gone in this game, and it's pretty freaking nuts down here, because it's just everything is just molten. Is that some diamond right there? A lot of sulfur, I'm hoping. Is this gold? Is this gold, actually? I don't really need that. It is kind of cool that you find gold and stuff down here, because it kind of makes sense. Geologically speaking, or geologically speaking. Um, but it is pretty cool. So what is down here? These look like the walls of, like, an inside of someone's intestine or something. Oh my god, there's Cthulhu Mama again. What do you want, Cthulhu Mama? I am what you see. Okay. Sounds cool to me. Trying to hang out, maybe be friends. So these guys, these are the blood mantas. I just heard something huge. What in Sam's hell is that? What is that? Uh, did he just shoot fire at me? That's a no-no, sir. Oh God, I'm, I'm dead. There's no way. I have no words. Oh, I can die from the floor. The floor is lava, quite literally. Oh, alien structure, come on, come on, just keep going. Just run from this guy. Where, did he just, did he just mesh into the wall? Okay, we're fine, I probably, probably not actually. If he, mesh, okay, he can probably mesh back out. Man, the creatures in this game really love just meshing this shit, don't they? Okay, we do need to be careful of all these aliens though. These guys teleport once, we're probably gonna be dead. We need to be really careful. Yeah, we need to be careful of those. We can't just go in one straight direction. We need to, like, move constantly. Oh, there's a door right here. Okay. Oh, my lordy. Get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <gasps> he was that close. Oh, my God. He's phased into the wall. Oh my god, are you kidding me? We don't have a tablet. That is... Oh my god. What's back there? It's just a cube, isn't it? Okay, if it's just a cube, I'm not that worried, but oh my god, we need a, we need a plan. Okay, that is not gonna work. Okay, we need a plan. Where can we go in here? Because if that, I, I think this is just a thing. It's a massive structure just to have that there. I'm gonna head this way. I feel like this is probably the spot to go. Maybe we can get higher up and get a vantage point, possibly. I need to keep an eye out for giant, giant guy. Giant guy is the one who I'm scared of because he can absolutely end my day. Like, I, I'm losing health just by being near him because I have to constantly run from him. I have to run on the lava, so that's just not- that's not gonna happen. We can't let that happen, we're gonna die if we do that. What the hell are these things, by the way? They're so weird. Little leeches or something. Little- little lava leeches. Okay, is there possibly a tunnel back here that I can see? Or is this just a cave that's not rendering in? Okay, it's a cave that's not rendering in, I think. I think our direction may be over there, honestly. I don't know, though. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Now, after looking around for a pretty fair bit amount of time, I've come to notice that there's literally nowhere else we can go except burn there. 
Now, obviously we need a tablet. I don't know what color it is. I hope it's purple or green or something that we already have, because that'd be a lot easier. Um, let's take a check see here really quick. What type is it? What color is it? Does it not show me? We need a blue tablet. Why am I so short? We need a blue tablet. We've never seen blue tablets before. So what we're gonna have to do probably, we're probably gonna go back up top to the to the base. And we're probably gonna probably have to call it an episode here. We definitely got farther with our exploration today, much, much farther. We found whatever the hell this area is, and whatever the hell that is, which is gonna be really cool. But we need to work on next episode is finding these um finding these blue tablets. Um, definitely something we're going to need to work on. So let me get back up top and I will cue you guys back in when I do, or if anything, oh god. You know, I kind of want to fight it. Do you really breathe fire? Is that how you work? Yeah, you definitely breathe fire. That's definitely how you work. You are definitely the scariest thing I've ever seen in my life. Very cool looking though, I'll tell you that much. You were definitely really cool. What is there a shortcut out of here by any chance, or am I just like stuck to contemplate my existence in here? Easy to come around for another pass, huh? I would love for there to be a way for me out of here, but it probably is not. and we are back and for some reason all of our support beams are just gone alrighty so we we didn't get a ton done this episode but we found some new things I think I think we made progress but not the way that I was expecting to make it because we went down we went farther than we've ever gone before you know we didn't get to use any of these guys unfortunately but I feel like I feel like next episode we will um, so what next episode is going to have to be is us working on tablets we need to get more blue ones we need to get blue ones. We haven't found those yet. We need to get purple ones, and we probably need to get green ones. We need to work on those three tablet types uh, during the next episode. And I'll probably be going around during that episode working on grabbing more of those. And um, we'll go ahead. I may look up how I get the blue ones just so I can know and save us the time. But I'd like to find everything as fresh as possible if I can. But anyways, guys, that's, that's stuff for next episode. Thank you guys so much for being here for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. I've gotten jump scared like five different times today, but you know, that's fine. <laughs> Makes good for content for you guys. Um, I really did enjoy this episode. We got really deep, and I'm really interested in that new le like Leviathan class thing, because that thing spits fire, dude. Like, and just spit fire all over the place, which is pretty nuts. So I'm hoping we can find more stuff about that guy. And hopefully next episode we can find out who the Cthulhu Mama is because she was talking to us for a bit there and she wants to help us and I'm assuming she wants us to help her in return or something like that. Once again, thank you so much for watching this video and if you're a great day or night wherever you are. If you are new here, please consider subscribing. If you enjoyed this video, consider dropping a comment down below. I'd really love to hear from you guys. And if you want to chat or hang out or just see what's going on with me, check out my social media links. They will be down in the description for you guys to look at. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day now wherever you are, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.